Hi everyone, my name is Emily McGee. I'm the secretary for the student chapter of the Wildlife Society. This summer, I am the intern at the Mies Wildlife Management Area. One of my main responsibilities is to trap turtles for an ongoing research project. Today, I'm gonna show you the turtle hoop net trap and how to set it. So what you need is the hoop net trap, the PVC pipe, sardines, and a crawfish trap. The first step is to bait your trap. We use sardines and once you open them, you place them inside of the crawfish trap and then you put the crawfish trap inside of the hoop net trap. Once you get the crawfish trap inside, you use a PVC pipe and you put the PVC pipe through the front holes of the trap. You want to make sure you get it inside both parts of the net on this side and this side so that the trap will stay open and you put it through the bottom too. Then you walk the turtle hoop net trap out into the water. Once you walk the trap out into the water, you want to find the right depth. You want to make sure there's enough air for the turtles to come up and breathe when they're inside of the trap. Then you want to stake your PVC pipe into the mud. The last step is to secure your turtle hoop net trap. You want to pull the string as high as you can so the trap remains upright and the entrance stays open. Then you tie your string to the anchoring point. In this case, we are using a fallen tree limb. Now that we've successfully set our turtle hoop net trap, we'll come back in the morning and see if we caught any turtles. Thanks for watching.